Alright, YouTube, what's up? Apple updated here. Uh, video here on how Apple's being sued, allegedly, uh, for their ads being misleading. Alright, guys, here we go. Alright guys, what's up? Apple Updater here, and a Apple Update for you guys. Um, sorry for not coming out with that many vids lately, I've been really tied up with the iTunes iPods and um, my other account, and uh, all the product videos and all the good stuff. Also guys, if you haven't noticed yet, AppleUpdaters.tk, go check it out, link over there in the video description. Um, Alright, so, in this video, I'm going to talk to you guys about how Apple is allegedly being sued over misleading ads. If you guys noticed, in the recent past, uh, Apple had TV ads about their iPhone 3G stating that it was half the price and twice as fast. Twice as fast as the whole, what this is all about. It's, the iPhone 3G is actually not twice as fast. They're being sued because of that misleading and, um, myth that because of that misleading and deceptive text. Um, they're saying, basically, they quoted, saying, we were truthful and accurate, and we're not misleading or deceptive. Um, they're basically saying there is that it takes a fool to realize that this isn't really twice as fast, and it takes a fool to actually take those claims at face value. Um, that's what they were basically saying right there. Um, so the iPhone 3G is not twice as fast as the original iPhone model. Uh, that is untrue. That is totally false. Um, the opposing party is suing because they actually thought that it was, that made more people want to buy it. They thought that it was more deceptive, uh, more deceptive of a statement, um, and that there was no reason for that. That they shouldn't really have had, they shouldn't have had to put that there because they're Apple. They shouldn't really need to put that. Um, this is, this hasn't, this isn't really much of a thing that's been going on lately, um, but it was just recently released about this whole statement. Um, it's been going on for about a couple months now. Um, their TV ad was banned, it was taken off, along with another TV ad, uh, about the iPhone 3G stating, uh, you want to surf the browse, you want to surf the internet faster, some want to search maps faster, some want to download attachments faster, stuff like that. That ad was removed from, um, television, so that you guys will no longer see that ad because of this whole, um, process that's been going on about this. Uh, the misleading text, um, the whole thing about that, um, they... They're not really sure when this thing is going to be over. Hopefully it will be over soon. Um, Apple was sued, so just some background information, that they were also sued for about the same thing back in 2005 for uh, misrepresenting the size of the hard drive shipping in the popular PowerBook G4. Um, they settled that for about 7500 I believe the price was, uh, $7,500 in, in legal fees, which is $7,500 for all you slow people out there. Um, so that's basically, guys, I just want to fill you in on what Apple's been up to about their iPhone stuff. Uh, just, that's basically it. Nothing else uh, in the news, really. Um, if there is anything, I'll get it out there to you guys as fast as I can. Um, that's basically it, guys. I just want to thank you guys for watching. Um, let me know what you think down below. If you think that it was maybe misleading that they said that, I do. I really think that they were misleading with this, and I have to, I have to join the plaintiff side and not Apple side. Sorry. Um that it was kind of misleading about twice as fast, and now they're saying, oh, well, it wouldn't take a fool to realize that. Come on, Apple, that, that's a little harsh. Um, well, that's basically it, guys. That's my Apple update for today. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Favorite, comment, rate, subscribe.